In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to turn your wireless network card on your laptop or computer into an access point for which you can share your internet through another local area network card or integrated NIC on your computer for other wireless devices close to your computer. First, you want to go to Control Panel, then Network Connections, and then you want to disable any other network connections that might be there and I'll tell you why in a couple of seconds and just make sure they're disabled and currently right now they are then right click on local air connection and do properties and then go to advanced and under internet connection sharing make sure to check the allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection you don't have to set up a firewall if you don't need to or it should be automatically set through Windows XP. Once that's done, go ahead and hit OK. And it should take a couple of seconds. And Windows XP should start sharing that connection. And you know it's sharing just by the hand appearing over there. Next, you want to go to your wireless network connection icon and right click on it and do properties. And then you want to click on configure first and this should take you to your the properties page of your wireless network card then you want to go to advanced in the advanced tab under AP operational mode if you have 11B devices or G devices select those but if you have a mixture of both you can do a mixed mode but I'm just gonna do 11B because I only have 11B devices channel to start your AP on access point on you can leave that to one device type by default your wireless card is set up as a wireless station but you want to turn this into an access point so you go ahead and choose access point and then the rest you can just leave them at their default value for SDA network type make sure that's set to infrastructure not ad hoc transmission rate I'm just gonna use the fastest one that I have and hit OK and now set up your wireless card as an access point but you want to give it an SSID for your wireless devices to identify so you go to wireless networks under after right clicking on your wireless network connection you go to wireless networks and then under preferred network networks you do add and then you just give it a name I'm gonna call this one blight Network authentication, leave that as open and data encryption. I'm not going to be using any, so I'm going to just disable that and hit OK. Then, once that's done, you want to go ahead and hit OK. And now I'm going to try and connect to it through using my PSP. And you see it says connected right now because I just connected to it with my PSP. And that's primarily it on setting up your wireless connection as an access point. And you can do this with two wireless cards if you have them. And instead of right clicking on your local area connection, you would just right click on your other network card. But always make sure to disable the other cards that are, you're not going to be using. And if you want to share your internet connection through different cards make sure to first bridge those cards first but that's for another tutorial